Zumanjaro, Drop of Doom it opened in New Jersey several years ago, and it is the tallest drop tower ride in the world. The height of the ride is more than 40 floors. This is almost twice the height of the Statue of Liberty. The ride features three open gondolas, each of which accommodates eight people. They slowly rise to 130 meters within 30 seconds. Then adrenaline seekers hang at this point for a few moments. And then comes the fun part. A 10-second freefall at a speed of 145 kilometers per hour. Well, there is always a certain degree of risk. However, the creators claim that the ride could easily support the weight of 30 large African elephants. Giant Canyon Swing in Colorado after all, this giant swing is installed right on the edge of the canyon, 400 meters above the Colorado River. The swing moves four passengers back and forth, takes them nearly vertical at the height of each swinging arc, and hits a top speed of 80 kilometers per hour. Like that. <laughs> Insanity Ride it is especially spectacular to ride it at night, when the entire Las Vegas basks in the glow. The ride, located 274 meters high, is somewhat of a carousel. After riders get on, it spins them in the open air at speeds of up to 65 kilometers per hour. You'll be propelled up to an angle of 70 degrees, which will tilt your body into one position, straight down. If you're brave enough to keep your eyes open, you'll be rewarded with a breathtaking view of Las Vegas. Formula Rasa in Abu Dhabi and it is located in the United Arab Emirates. Many tourists from all over the world come here for one single ride, a roller coaster called Formula Rasa. It is considered the fastest roller coaster in the world. The total length of the track is a little more than 2 kilometers, and the entire ride lasts one and a half minutes. Tower of Terror in Australia Shaped like a letter L, the ride has three parts. A tunnel, a small section of a direct track, and a 115-meter high tower. Your ride begins in a closed tunnel a couple of hundred meters long. The train starts moving and accelerates to 160 kilometers per hour with the help of a special powerful engine. And in a couple of seconds, the track then pitches up 90 degrees to the vertical. The trailer stops at the top of the tower for a couple of seconds and then rushes to the ground in free fall and then goes back into the tunnel. The main train can take up to 15 passengers at a time, and it weighs 6 tons. 